Just sat and built my bathroom cabinet so I didn't have to do it at the other place. And it's really cute, I'm excited. I guess all the pipes go like down there. Then I've got like a bamboo wood thing to go on top and then the sink's gonna go on top. So it took about three hours. <laughs> Good morning guys today we have come to the new place just dropping a few things off the builders were supposed to start today on monday but their last job has just run over a couple of days so they're starting on wednesday but that's actually okay because we went to london on saturday so we like lost a whole day where we were meant to do this so it's actually worked out for the best but i've just bought them some tea and sugar and biscuits and a kettle and some sweets and some cups we've also just brought the hoover round and all of these bits because i'm gonna start painting this this tomorrow which i'm so excited for oh i just can't wait for this purple wall to be gone it's like my least favorite color i think especially mixed with the gray and these i'm dying to take these down copper and rose gold are like my two worst metals so these not my cup of tea <laughs> so we're gonna go back to my flat and pick up the bin and the bathroom cabinet that I built yesterday and bring those round next and then i think that's about it for everything that the builders are gonna need so this is all the stuff that we've already got. I think I've got a package downstairs as well. These are my black sink plugs for the bathroom. I just got these on Amazon, but look how nice they are. And then they just click push to open and close. Guys, I've just got my first box delivered to my new place and it is from Nationwide. This is who my mortgage went through. So I guess they just sent me a little box. So we've got popcorn, Zaflora, which I've never tried before and I've always wanted to. Tea. Wow. Toilet rolls, we were just about to go and buy some. Bin bags at the bottom. Oh my God, the thought of everything. Hey. <laughs> oh, I love these biscuits. Oh my God, we were just about to buy more biscuits for the builders as well. We've got oat cakes, an oat bar, a sponge, sugar. Add it to the other sugar. Kitchen roll. That's so nice. <laughs> I did not expect that. It's been four weeks since you called and I've been waiting here for you all along. I've been waiting here for you all along Where you been? Where did you go? I wonder if you found what you're looking for Wonder if you found what you're looking for I hope it's not too late I want you back here with me Never should have said it's better this way I'd rather be with you than someone I don't know Now it's like we're living in two separate worlds Come on back to me. Just popped Tesco for stuff for the other place Because I'm going to be there painting for the next couple of days And obviously the builders are coming on Wednesday So I got some stuff for them But for the fridge I just got some cap Sun and some crunchy nut. I'm pretty much just going to be taking this and some soups, I think, just to have when I'm there. I got these for the builders, but these are my favourite, so I might pinch them. I got these mug shots as well because I've got a kettle over there, so they'll be okay. And some rainbow drops, some bananas, got some coffee for over there, and some coconut and almond milk. And then for food, we've just stocked up on cherries, some cod fillets, gluten free bread grapes more rainbow drops got some bicarbonate of soda because mom's doing something with that got some lemons some e-cover it's like fairy liquid some tomatoes some tissues for me some peppermint tea and some kerry gold butter so there's a little haul so mom is working on the fridge today mom's actually decided to just try and clean the kitchen while i paint she don't like painting do you nope. hates painting so she's gonna clean instead 
And it's difficult with the dodgy ends. Yeah. But that's fine with me because I hate cleaning dirty things. So I'll leave mum to that and I'm gonna start painting the hall. The hall? I'm not painting the hall. I'm painting. <laughs> what am I painting? I'm not quite awake. I'm doing the shelving unit in the dining room and I think it's going to be kind of a hard job because oh there's all of the shelves in it and like I said in time I'm going to actually be getting them taken out but for now I can't deal with the purple so I'm going to paint them until that happens. My ideal situation is to have all of them taken out and then to have these, I'll put a picture on screen, built in at either side of the fireplace just for more storage for like my hoover, my mops, like all the things that need to go away. For now, it's gonna stay looking like a gigantic wine rack. And I actually bought the wrong paint color because I did want to paint this white. And I bought the color called Rock Salt by Dulux. And I showed it in my vlog and everyone was like, that's actually really, really, really like the palest gray you can get. But I'm just gonna roll with it now because we don't really have time to go and change it. And obviously it's gonna be ripped out like somewhere down the line anyway. So I'm just gonna do it that light gray shade. At least it'll look a little bit better and brighter. The reason why we're here today is because we've got three deliveries. We've got my bath and my mirror for above the sink in the bathroom come in. And then we've got my shower tray and my shower screen. So they're all arriving today. So I just thought I would get cracking. First thing to do is dust them. I'm gonna dust them and then I've got a sponge and I'm just gonna wash them down. Oh my God, look at the dust on these. They're clean ones. Ew! <laughs> So I've decided I'm gonna start with the fireplace and the wall around it, because I think that's gonna make the biggest difference and it's gonna be the easiest, because all of these are gonna be so difficult to paint. I'm actually kind of daunted right now by it. It's gonna take so long. The day starts like the rest we've seen Another car and copy of an old routine The days keep coming They keep coming I'm an arrow, can you stop me? I can go wherever I want be I'm the fire, can you tame me? I will stand out and catch you slowly I feel like a hurricane going round and round in my veins Yeah, you try this time and time again
I would give you a little update. Today has been a mad one. Basically, my shower screen got delivered and they weren't allowed to bring it anywhere like up the stairs. They had to leave it on the drive. But they didn't just leave the shower screen in the box, which would have been fine because we've just left that downstairs until the builders come. They brought it on this massive crate that was so heavy. Like me and mum could not even lift the crate that it came on. And I don't know why they left that, but basically we were trying to knock it apart for like half an hour so we could get it in mum's car to go to the skip and we just couldn't do it at all and we were hitting like that really annoyed point where you're just like why does nothing go right and then my lovely neighbors popped around and said hello and saw that we were struggling the lady sent her husband who works in the building trade i think to come and help us and he helped us and honestly i've never been so grateful for anything in my whole life and i'm also so thrilled that i have nice neighbors if you guys know at my flat i don't really have the best neighbors so i've met them and they're lovely and like they've given me their number and her husband knows loads of tradespeople if i need anyone Ever. and they've said like if I ever need anything I can just pop around and knock on the door and do you know how grateful I am for that I nearly just choked on my own spit that is how grateful I am I've not had neighbors like that since I lived in London so my last one two my last two or three flats and obviously this is a place that I've bought so the fact that I've got nice neighbors here or at least a couple, I haven't met anyone else, just makes my heart so happy. But yeah, then we had to break it apart, obviously, with the help of her husband, and mom and I then took it to the skip, and then we came back. We ordered McDonald's, because we were so hungry. I didn't really eat mine, because I was feeling stressy. And then I've just been painting for the rest of the time, so I thought I would show you where I'm up to. So this has needed three coats, and I've just kind of concentrated on the middle bit for now. But if I stand back, you can see that is what I've done. So that has got two coats, sorry, not three. I need to do a third. And then I've got started on these as well. So all of the white ones have obviously got two coats on. These have just got one coat. I've just finished them, but I'm running out of paint. So mum's actually just gone to home base to get some more. Golly, I still have so much to do, but I genuinely think this is really good progress for today because I've tried to be so neat about it. I don't know how long I'm gonna have this unit for. It could be a couple of months or it could be a couple of years, depending in what I prioritize and like how nice it looks after I've done it so I have tried to do like quite a good job but yeah this just needs one more coat and then it's done look at my hands I'm just gonna do a second coat on this little bit of skirting board down here just because it's got one coat so I'm gonna do that and then wait for mum and then I might carry on I'm not sure I'm in the zone for it now it's been literally we got here at 9 a.m and I think it's 5 p.m so it has taken so long but I'm genuinely really pleased with what I've done I've just got all of this to do now and I'm kind of on a roll with the cubby holes now like I know how to do them the best now I don't think they'll take me that long maybe this will all be done by tomorrow as in by the end of tomorrow <laughs> Okay, I've just sat and done another coat on the middle wall. So that's now got three coats on and that is finished. I'm not doing any more on that. Actually, maybe I need to do another coat in the middle. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> I've done three coats on that shelf. These have two, those have one, these have none. But I'm gonna call it a day. It is nearly 8 p.m. <laughs> I wanna go to bed. Good morning, everybody. Back at the flat today, just waiting for the builders because they're starting today, which is so exciting. But I'm also kind of nervous because this is like the first ever renovation thing I've ever done. So I don't know, just feel kind of nervous about it. I'm gonna carry on with the wall today. I'll update you how far I get with the wall, I guess, but I'm not showing you the bathroom because that's gonna be its own separate video. First little look at the wall today. It's dried perfectly. So good. So today I'm gonna do three coats on all of these. I'm gonna move up one level, I think, but I actually can't even reach these even on my step ladder. I've only got a three step one. So I need to buy like a five step one to actually get up there. So I think I'm just gonna do these ones and then get started on this side. I'm dead excited. The builders are
quite quiet because I don't actually know where the builder is. I think he's just popped out, but I'm not sure. <laughs> I just went into the bathroom and it is looking so good. It has been completely demolished and it's just making me so excited like it's really real now. I just can't wait to get my kitchen done now. <laughs> Mum's just brought me my favourite sandwich from my favourite sandwich shop. It's in the Hove, it's called Rojo's. I just get a white bat with ham in it and it is literally 10 out of 10. Delicious. Mm. I used to get one of these after all my operations. It's like the one thing I've really craved. <laughs> Okay guys, I'm leaving it at this today. I bet it barely looks any different, but I actually have done quite a lot today. So firstly, I've painted this wall, as you can see, but I've also done two coats on all of these and obviously just one coat on them. And over here, I've finished off all of these boxes, done three coats on all of them, and then two coats on these, three coats on that one, I think. So yeah, tomorrow I reckon this will all be finished if I get my arse in gear, which will be fabulous. Good morning guys, it is day three of painting this shelf wall and I'm kind of determined to get it done today. It's actually 8am so we're starting an hour early by we I mean me. Oh I just want to get it done or at least get two coats done because obviously it needs three coats and each coat needs four hours in between to dry so I don't know like how realistic it is to get it all done today but hopefully I could get two coats. Let's do this. So mum today is going to be working on this. I've obviously hung so many pictures on this wall. And you are the pro, Polly Filler. <laughs> we'll see. No, you are good at it though, aren't you? I don't mind doing it. It's something I can actually do. Yeah. So mum is going to get rid of all of these while I paint. I'm going to start on these ones. So I've started on the top layer, which are horrendous to paint. I'm really not looking forward to having to do this three times for three coats but i've run out of paint right on that last edge how annoying is that so we're gonna have to go buy some paint now i really want to finish this today but i don't know if i will I have finished, kind of. I've still got one more coat to do on the top two rows, but I can show you how it looks now because it pretty much looks finished. I can't show you it finished tomorrow because I need to upload this video tonight because I'm gonna be here tomorrow and I don't have internet here. So, oh my God, I'm so sweaty right now. <laughs> here we go. This is a wall pretty much finished. As you can see, the top does need an extra coat, but I'm so happy with this. I'm absolutely chuffed and exhausted. This has taken three days and believe me, every single bit of me aches, which I did not expect. But now the next job is to paint all of these walls. Mum's been filling the holes to make them all match. I've already done like that little bit. As you can see, the color is actually very light gray. I've got some on the ceiling, so I'm gonna have to paint the ceiling white after. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna go now because oh, I'm literally exhausted. I'm gonna go to bed. What time is it? Half past 6 p.m. We've been here since 8 a.m. Give this vlog a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. And I will see you on Sunday. Bye.